What's up everybody, Tony with High Tech Check, and today we're going to take a look at a case made by Humix for the Galaxy Flip 4. And I will be putting links in the description in case you guys want to pick up this case yourself. And if you guys like me and you want to support my channel, please use those links because it helps me keep purchasing products to do reach you guys. So let's go and get started. So here is the case itself. And it also comes with two camera lens protectors. So the first thing you're going to want to do is to thoroughly clean off the camera lenses because whatever is on there after you put the lens protector on is going to remain there and you don't want that. So after you've cleaned off the lenses, we'll go ahead and take the little protector here. We'll just peel back the little plastic piece here, making sure you don't touch the underside of the lens protector. Then all we need to do is simply just place it over the cameras. and then just press it into place. And there we go, now your camera lenses are protected. And if you're wondering about the camera quality after you put the lens protectors on there, as you can see the quality is just as good as before we put the lens covers on. And here's a picture that I just took. Looks pretty clear to me. So now we'll go ahead and put on our case. All I need to do is simply just put this over one end and then clip on the other side, just like that. And then you can do the same thing for the bottom half. And there we go. So it does have a nice frosted back surrounded by a black rubber. Very cool looking, feels really nice in the hand, nice and grippy. You don't have to worry about it slipping out of your hand. As you can see, if we turn it to the side, there is a raised edge to protect your screen. You got your cutouts on the bottom here. It doesn't add a lot of bulk to the phone either. Doesn't slide off when you open it up. Looks really nice. As you can see the protector for the lens and the screen here. All the cutouts are perfectly aligned. It does have some nice little extra protection in the edges here as you can see the little bubble it's got your serrated volume buttons that are separated which I love it's got a nice little cutout for the power button and then if we look at the back here as you can see there's a nice recession to protect your screen and your camera lenses even though we do have the camera lens protector on there there's still a nice little raised edge buttons are clicky easily accessible very nice, and your fingerprint sensor still works perfectly fine. And if you're wondering if it works with wireless charging, no issues there. As you can see, it doesn't slide on and off either. It's on there pretty good. And there's no issues when you open and close the case itself. So again, I will be putting a link in the description in case you guys want to pick this case up yourself. And if you guys like me and you want to support my channel, please use those links because it helps me keep purchasing products to review to you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that little notification bell so that you guys know when I put out new videos. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next one. Later.